Hi. The song I have for you today is called My Neighbor, Mr. Pratt, and it's written from the viewpoint of a neighbor of a famous person who doesn't actually use that name. He goes by a different name. And this is 1960s London in a very fashionable subdivision called Godalming. It's called My Neighbor, Mr. Pratt. My neighbor, Mr. Pratt, is as nice as can be Here in Godalming, outside of London in Surrey With his wife, Evie, she's his sixth They're highly respected, but as neighbors they don't mix His family is filled with diplomats Who've served England all over the map His grandma was a princess a beautiful tie, her story was the basis for the king and I. Mr. Pratt's rather tall and kind and dark, he acted in plays where he got his start. That's hard to imagine, he has a lisp in his speech. He's a bit standoffish and hard to reach. He worked in movies overseas in the U.S. You know, I don't know why people make such a fuss. Fame can do things to you and so you harden. So we leave him alone to putz around in his garden. The Pratts occasionally entertain showbiz folks. Bella Gosey stopped by and they laughed and they joked. The two of them would hoot and howl late into the night. Voices that if you listened were quite a fright. He just got back to Godalming from London where he did some voiceover thing. I don't know how he could make any money or get rich doing the voice of something called the Grinch. Mr. Pratt hates Halloween more and more and doesn't come out until November 4th. People stop at his door and I hope he's not put out. Cause all the kids want treats from Boris Karloff. <laughs> My neighbor, Mr. Pratt.